with an algorithm, I'm thinking that it doesn't matter what percentage it is, as long as you have the right filters on it. We'll see. Yo, Corbe, what up, dude? 777. 777, read message above. Kansas City 2E getting money. Okay, I read it. <laughs> I read your message above, bud. 0.2, it was a good message. It was a good message and I'm glad you're here. So much love to you. Pump fun API. I'm s well, we might use this probably not, but probably not. Probably not. Maybe though, maybe for data, maybe. So what I'm going to do here is actually go ahead and make a little note sheet because actually let's go ahead and make a terminal. Mm. Create a new repo. Pump fun trading. Open in Visual Studio. Let's go ahead and trust authors because that's me cuz I'm the author. I'm the author now. All right. I'm the author. I am the author. All right. Let's go ahead and make this a little smaller so we can get both of these thug thizzles up in here. Should we just update Virtual Studio Code now? Visual Studio Code? Virtual Studio? Visual? Visual Virtual? No. I'm not going to update, update it. Pump. One bot. Okay. Let's go ahead and just put some documentation here. So data, uh, BitQuery. API for data. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Pump portal dot fun. Pump. Fun unofficial API pump portal. Okay. All right, sick. So we got some thug fizzles up in here. Notice 90 to 96% of the bonding curve. Explain yourself, sir. Explain yourself, sir. Pump fun. Okay. Hello, beauty fallen says, what up, dude? How are you? Vipratrini says, no, maybe it didn't post. Yeah, I don't think it posted. I didn't see anything from you, Vap. This is the first thing I've seen from you. Good to see you, though. Much love. So let's go ahead and read through this. So a third party API for Radium and Pump Fun. We use HTTPS endpoint that allow you to programmatically trade on and gather data, the pump fund bonding curve and radium LPs. Please, uh, please explain the bonding curve on pump fund. They're probably like, oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. This boy don't know what the bonding curve is. Bonding curve. I don't know nothing, dude. I'm just here learning everything. Much love to you though. What is the bonding curve? Pump fund utilizes a bonding curve model as a way of providing guaranteed liquidity for newly launched tokens. Once they make it to radium, an automated market maker on the Solana blockchain, the bonding curve model takes a small amount of token purchases and allocates it to the curve. Once the token reaches 63,000, it should be 69,000. Come on, pump. Come on, little pump. Once a token reaches 63,000 market cap, the bonding curve is completed and the token is launched on radium. Okay, that's that's something to note. Um, once the token reaches 63K market cap, the bonding curve 
is completed and token is launched on radium i gotta get super educated on this before i build it right so um please excuse my ignorance here i've faded this for a long long time i've faded it for a long long time and is it the time now probably not but we'll see In short, this means that the token can be never can never be made fully liquid, and traders can sell even if the price falls drastically. The model pr privileges early users as the number of tokens sent to the bonding curve at a lower valuation is less expensive than for users who buy the token at a dollar figure value. Will this incentivize? Will this incentive prevent rug pulls? While the $80 reward is an incentive for token creators to get their tokens all the way to market, it may not be enough to stop rug pulls on the platform. By the way, you can see my sniper here. There's only two open positions, and one of them is USDC. So it has this moth position open still. But you can see it's just not like, it's not doing what it used to do. It's not finding as many tokens, and that's just, it is what it is. It is what it is, B. So uh, my hypothesis is it's not finding as many tokens because Pump Fund's taking all the volume. So if Pump Fund's taking all the volume, I got to investigate. Traders who are quick off the market can buy early and dump their tokens before the bonding curve is completed. Something users claim happens frequently on the platform. However, even if a token completes its bonding curve, it does not mean they can no longer be rugged. Other large holders of the token can still dump their entire positions after launch and price price the drive down. I'm dyslexic as, as, as a mother, bro. <laughs> While only a few tokens deployed on pump.fun have reached Outsized valuations, the platform has been raking in massive revenues from the 1% fee it charges on all trades that occur on the platform. Damn, 1%, dog. 1%, dog. Wow. We're in the wrong business, B. <laughs> but Pump Fund creator is probably going to go to jail. <laughs> if he's in the U.S., who created Pump Fund? Let's go ahead and check it out. Who created pump fun alan okay let's go ahead and see how long he has for freedom alan is the creator of pump fun so let's go check this dude out see how long he's got his freedom for don't take don't take cash over freedom fellas please don't do it don't do it don't launch a token don't do none of that please 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 don't do it all right Please, it's not not going to be worth it, dude. Please don't do it. Maybe if you're in a different country, but no. Not here in the U.S. of A. Don't do it, dog. Let's go check him out. Alon. See where he's located. Accelerating.